Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, November 10, 1865, Major Henry Wurz was hung in Washington, D.C. at the age of 41 for the murder and abuse of Union prisoners during the American Civil War. Wurz was the commandment of Andersonville, the infamous Confederate prison which once contained as many as 35,000 prisoners. Born in Zurich, Switzerland, Wurz demonstrated an early interest in medicine but could not afford an expensive education. He was forced to leave Switzerland and eventually came to the United States in 1845, becoming the director of a water cure establishment in Louisville, Kentucky. There he met wealthy Natchez planter Levin Marshall who hired him as an overseer for his Louisiana plantation. Wurz enlisted in the 4th Louisiana Infantry and lost his right arm in the Battle of Seven Pines. He served under General John Winder, who was in charge of the Confederate prison camps. Upon his return from a mission to Europe in 1864, Wurz assumed command of the prison at Andersonville. Under his direction, Union troops died by the thousands. During his trial, Wurz was found guilty of 13 counts of murder, in addition to impairing the lives of Union prisoners of war. Wurz was hung at the old capital prison, the site of present-day Supreme Court of the United States. Hi, my name is Sophia Rodriguez. I'm an eighth grader at Trinity Episcopal, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.